everybody, Magma here with a LEGO Star Wars review, this time from 2008 slash 2009, this is more of a 2008 set, um, here we have the set 7669, Anakin's Jedi Starfighter, ages 7 to 12, and um, I'm going to talk about the box before the actual set. The box um, appeared in two ways, the way um, that I'm going to show you right now, the box that I have. So this box, um, the box had Clone Wars to advertise that Clone Wars was starting to come out and we, w we should be updated about that. So the box appeared like this and appeared like all the Clone Wars sets. Um, a bit later like this. So the box had two formats. I'm not sure which was uh, more used than the other one. But um, that is definitely something to know about this set is that um, it is one of the rare sets appeared as um, two different ways. So um, we're going to go ahead. I'm going to talk about the minifigures now. Alright. So as we continue, um, first minifigure we have is a new, brand new Anakin Skywalker. Um, so he has the new Clone Wars head. All right. So um, he has the new uh, Clone Wars face um, with the eyes and the big mouth and the weird scars. So that is extremely ugly. I'm gonna have to say it this way with a hairpiece that's alright for him. So the new heads are extremely ugly towards me. Um, the clones are okay because they have helmets but all the other minifigures. Um, these new heads are extremely ugly towards me. I mean it's taking all the Lego out of the minifigures. I mean the little eyes are now becoming ugly faces. I honestly find this really sad but only a few more years until they finally stop Clone Wars and make decent um, minifigures. There, there has been d decent minifigures, but they have had these big eyes ruining them. So he comes with a lightsaber, chest printing, and that's it. So yeah, the lightsaber just fell. Let me go get that for you guys. Oh, okay. So, uh, my Anakin. Wow, it keeps falling off. Um, something to know about this set um, that could be interesting is that I think that LEGO has lost their quality knowing that this hand um, broke really easily and the minifigure is breaking itself apart slowly, um, quite easily. My, my 1999 minifigures are holding better than this guy, which is brand new and I haven't barely used. So that's something to take in mind. Has LEGO probably um, lowered their quality to make more sets? More money? I don't think so, because oh, I think that there has been a wave of um, bad quality that was then fixed, knowing that the later upcoming sets had much better quality. These hands are very poor. Brand new R2-D2, um, this version of him is quite cool. This is the Clone Wars version, so the top part is grey, they try to make him, make him look more accurate towards the Clone Wars. Honestly R2-D2 have so many versions of this guy that it doesn't even matter anymore. Um, no lightsaber holder for this review, um, for this set I mean, and um, so R2-D2 fits right in here, and this you just take the cockpit off, and you fit him right in there. Pretty basic, let me give you a show around. Alright. Try to get the camera to focus. All right, so um, pretty cool cockpit. R2 has a space in by pushing this. I'll show you what it does. Um, flick fire missile on both sides. Landing gear, you know how that works. All right, so 
by pushing this, by pushing it, um, a mechanism should be able to pop R2D2 out and he will eventually fall. This kind of mechanism, um, mechanism does not work, so I've already tried it a thousand times. I'll try it once more for the audience. Um, if I get lucky and I push it hard enough, it might um, barely pop out R2D2. So, so there we go. <laughs> Give it one more try, another shot. Whoops. Ah, come on, get there. There we go. So he flew out, but wow, <laughs> just lucky, I guess. Um, usually it doesn't work. It's um, a system to give this set a feature. Kind of lame. We got this um, non-printed pieces. This is a sticker. So, yeah, the ship. Here's a better view of it. And I'm going to show you the box right now. So, this is the box we get or depending on which kind of box you get. Six, no, 7669 is the number. Cockpit, landing gear, droid feature, missiles. Um, I won't review this, I have reviewed this one. And I have reviewed this one, I will review the 2014 version of this guy. Um, so yeah, so giving last look at the older box or newer box so yeah this is the end of the review hope you enjoyed it and catch you next time guys